Let's Build Airgun, I'm going to review the Makarov Air Pistol by Umarex. The Makarov Air Pistol comes in a collectible box. Legends is the branding Umarex uses for its line of air guns that are replicas of real firearms. The history of the Russian Makarov firearm pistol is emblazoned on the inside lid of the box, both in English and French. The name Makarov is proudly engraved on the left side of this air pistol slide. Its plastic grip, made to look like Bakelite, bears the Russian star insignia. This air pistol even has a lanyard ring like the prototype. In December 1945, Russia set forth contests for a new 9mm service pistol to replace the bulky Tokarev TT-33 and the Nagant M1895 revolver. In 1951, the Makarov pistol, or PM, was adopted as the Soviet Union standard military sidearm. Designer Nikolai Makarov and team improved reliability and reduced parts count from the previous Russian sidearm offerings. This made the Makarov easy to manufacture and service. The capture of German tooling, technology, and machinery during World War II greatly aided in the improvements the Makarov had over previous Russian sidearms. The Makarov was widely adopted by other Eastern Bloc countries during the Cold War. It's easy to see that Makarov's design was greatly influenced by the German Walter PPK. The Makarov is a semi-auto double-action air pistol. It is powered by a 12-gram CO2 cartridge housed in the grip. This air pistol shoots .177 caliber steel BBs at velocities up to 380 FPS. The Makarov has a metal frame and slide. It does not have blowback action, however, the slide is movable and the hammer moves during firing. This air pistol has a front fixed and rear sights. The Makarov weighs 12.4 ounces or 352 grams. Its overall length is 6.4 inches or 16.2 centimeters. The Makarov safety is located on the left side in front of the hammer. To engage the safety, slide the safety switch towards F. To disengage the safety, slide the safety switch towards S. Engage the safety. Open the grip cover by pulling straight back. Turn the piercing wing fully counterclockwise. Place a drop of either Pelgun oil or RWS chamber lube on the tip of the CO2 cartridge. Insert the CO2 cartridge tip up into the air pistol. Turn the piercing wing clockwise until you hear the hiss of CO2 entering the air pistol. Close the grip cover. Disengage the safety when ready to fire. Engage the safety. Press the magazine release button. The magazine will drop from the bottom of the grip. Pull down the BB follower until it locks in place. Insert up to 18 BBs into the BB loading port. Slowly release the BB follower. Insert the magazine into the air gun. Disengage the safety when ready to fire. A neat tidbit that is not included in the manual is that the Makarov slide is removable.
The macro rifle can be shot in both single and double action mode. Trigger pull is fairly heavy, but consistent through the pull. As you can see, I was able to get all shots within an inch diameter of the target. Accuracy of the Makarov is fairly good for a smoothbore air pistol. The resemblance of the Umarex Makarov air pistol to the real Russian firearm is uncanny. Now you could have a working air gun replica of this historic communist block firearm. Please like this post and subscribe to Rustboat Airgun so that you're alerted to my future posts. Thank you.